My name is Professor Sheila Graham and the focus of my research here at the Centre for Virus Research is human papillomavirus. Human papillomavirus is very famous as a can because it ca causes a cancer of women, it causes cervical cancer. But more and more over the last 10 years we've begun to understand that it also causes a number of other cancers. Particularly there's an epidemic of head and neck cancers, particularly in males, coming up at the moment. So it's a very important virus to study. So my laboratory study the basic virology of human papillomavirus and that's quite interesting because human papillomavirus infects the epithelium and so we have to understand epithelial biology as well. So we're virologists and biologists. So we study the infection biology of human papillomavirus but we also, un we also want to have a translational clinical aspect to our research and we collaborate with a lot of clinicians and clinical virologists in Scotland to um, investigate clinical aspects of human papillomavirus and how it causes cancers and precancerous lesions. And I'm part of an organisation called the Scottish Human Papillomavirus Investigators Network, shortened to SHINE, and we have regular meetings to discuss clinical aspects of human papillomavirus. The longer term goals and objectives of the work in my laboratory at the CVR are to develop new therapies um, and new therapies against human papillomavirus associated diseases. There's a vaccine against human papillomavirus that was rolled out in the UK in 2008 and it's delivered to 12 to 13 year old girls in, in first and second year at school. But that's a prophylactic vaccine and that means that women older than 12 and 13 uh, in 2008 will continue to get human papillomavirus related disease and of course we're actually not vaccinating men so men will continue to get human papillomavirus associated disease. So we want to design new therapies that can be used to treat those diseases. The second aim of the research in my laboratory at the CVR is to develop new tests to detect human papillomavirus in patients before they get cancer so that we can triage patients who will never get cancer and say you don't need to come to the clinic and we can identify those patients who are highly likely to get cancer and send them as quickly as possible to the clinic and the aim of that research is to stop anxiety for the patient and the patient does get very anxious but also to reduce costs for the NHS. There are many aspects that I enjoy about the CVR in terms of working here. I think it's an extremely collegiate environment, I think that's number one. Everybody is very, very helpful um, and everybody collaborates and um, we're encouraged to collaborate. There's a very multidisciplinary aspect to the centre which is very, very useful um, and lately we've increased our clinical collaborations which for my research is particularly useful. If I knew somebody who was considering coming to work at the Centre for Virus Research, the main thing I would tell them is come and don't even think about it. It's for a second come because it's a fantastic environment in which to work. It's extremely supportive, extremely collegiate. We've got multidisciplinary research that would suit anybody wanting to get into any kind of viral research. And it's really very wide ranging. I think they would find it a, a fantastic international centre to come and work and I think we're building on our reputation year on year.